all right welcome to today's construction class so to solve the question on the screen i'm going to click on start to the sketch pick any plane all right so then the next thing is i'm going to pick my uh, rectangle okay in this manner so starting from this midpoint yeah height of 15 then span of 70 all right that's it over there having that now i'm going to pick my line and heading from from this edge i will extend it backward towards uh any dimension it has no dimension then i'm going to what draw a vertical line here in this manner then pick my dimension this line down to this end here mark of 80 all right so that's being said to then i'm going to what pick uh my arc center point arc all right in this manner from this mark of 80 which is here all right so extending to this edge right here i'm going to what draw this arc okay make it very big in this manner all right so from this same junction all right i pick arc of what 50 enter and i would i draw it also towards this direction as you can see can you see that okay so after doing that after doing that i'm going to pick my line in heading from all right i'm going to draw an horizontal line right here in this manner pick my dimension that line down here dimension is what mark of 10 enter so then i'm going to what, pick my arc now still in dying from from this same center radius of uh 40 yeah 40 enter then i'm going to what, draw the arc there okay now removing the hidden details of the thing then from this same center with my arc i'm going to draw an arc of radius what radius 10 enter then i was i draw this arc that you are seeing on the screen right there okay so after doing that i'm going to come down here all right with my hidden line yeah with my hidden line from the bottom here draw a line like this towards the top so pick my dimension to bar year to year make this line what mark of 10 enter okay so then i'm going to what pick my straight line right here draw an horizontal line hidden line also in this manner then pick my dimension from that horizontal line to the bottom right here mark of what mark of 50 enter okay so i'm going to pick my what my arc remove the hidden details symbol then from this junction right here okay yeah from this junction right here I'm going to draw an arc of radius 50 enter so i draw that as it is as you can see on the screen okay so from this same junction all right radius 50 minus 5 is already source 45 so it is going to be what hidden all right so from this area radius 45 enter and i'm going to what draw in that manner as you can see okay coming back here from this junction arc of radius what radius 55 enter then i'm going to what draw your diagram. around okay as you can see now i'm having what that junction so removing the hidden details from this junction right here okay so with radius what with radius 5 enter i would i draw the arc you are seeing on the screen right there okay after doing that, I'm going to what, pick my trim. Trim this off, trim this off, trim this off, trim this. Okay. So, let me apply my constraint here once and for all. So, and this area also. I'm going to trim this off, 
trim this off all right i'm going to go trim that off okay then all right all right so already in place so back to this area now back to this area so i'm going to pick my arc all right with hidden line standing right here yeah i'm going to draw an arc of radius 87 87 enter i was i draw the arc you are seeing there okay so that's it so removing the hidden line stuff from this center now yeah from this center placing my arc i'm drawing an arc of radius what radius 7 now with radius 7 I draw this first arc as you can see on the screen. Okay, so picking my heading details from the center here towards the top here, arc of radius what's radius 12. Enter. I'm going to strike that arc right there. So at this point of intersection, removing the details, this point of intersection, placing my compass there. Okay, I'm drawing an arc of radius 5. Enter. Which is what you are seeing on the screen right there. Okay, so that's it. Okay, it's not touching it, so I need to make it touch it here to here. All right, so that's it. So then I'm going to pick my trim. I'm going to pick my agent constraint here to here, right here to here, set to the already, then here to here. Okay, all right. So after that, I'm going to what click my what my finish sketch. After clicking my finish sketch, I'm going to what pick my what extrude with my extrude this and this. So let me use mark of. 30. So then what? Okay. So that's it. So I'm just going to pick the visual realistic. Okay. So that is it. I can change the material to something better. Something like, let's say, a gold. You can see. Something like this. So it looks what? Far, far better. Then I'm going to what? Uh, save it. All right. So kindly ensure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and also refer to your friends who might be in need of it. Thank you.